winter adventures in the snow. You need a vehicle with all-wheel drive to cope with these extreme conditions, and no one knows how to deal with snow and ice better than the Swedes. From the outside, the new cross-country model doesn't look very different from a standard V90, apart from its protective body cladding and a ground clearance of 21 centimeters. It also comes with typical Volvo LED headlights. The crossover model aims to combine design with functionality. This is not completely new terrain for Volvo. The Swedish car makers brought out their first cross-country model 20 years ago, the smaller V70 XC. With the V90 cross-country, Volvo wants to give motorists the freedom to get out and about in the country without the need for an SUV. All-wheel drive comes as standard in the luxury vehicle. We're testing the most powerful diesel D5 Pro with an output of 173 kilowatts. It takes the practically two-ton vehicle 7.5 seconds to accelerate from zero to 100 kilometers an hour. In Germany, the car will set you back around 63,500 euros. You can choose from four different types of engine, with performance outputs ranging from 140 to 235 kilowatts. Volvo wants access to as many possible markets worldwide. On rough ground, the V90 cross-country becomes a real fun ride.